Two men and two women who arrived at court included two Westminster and five Stormont MPs. Two others, Gerard Fitt and Patrick Devlin, didn't show up. They were accused under the Special Powers Act of having taken part in an illegal march. Conviction carries a possible jail sentence, though this can be suspended. Police patrolled both inside and outside the court, and two women were arrested. While demonstrators chanted, the seven defence lawyers fought a legal battle to get the hearing adjourned to give them time to prepare their defence. When the Crown solicitor opposed the delay, the defence threatened to walk out. After nearly an hour of argument, the case was adjourned until March the 15th. Christopher Wayne, ITN, Newry. In custody in Dublin's Mountjoy prison for three weeks. They'd been arrested after a border gun battle between the IRA and British troops last month and charged with having an anti-tank gun and seven rifles under their control. 5,000 rounds were fired during the battle and afterwards Meehan was quoted as saying, we gave them hell while it lasted. The cases weren't called until this afternoon and they were dealt with in less than five minutes. The district judge, Justice Dermot Dunleavy, brought the seven men into court in turn and told them he was satisfied beyond all doubt that the evidence wasn't sufficient to send them for trial. I talked to Meehan and Doherty as they left the courthouse. 